Okay, so first things first. If you haven't gotten the the, the material list um, available, the list of materials, there's a video that is called List of Materials. It's free, you can go watch it. If you haven't gotten that, please go get that so that you can see what my color palette looks like, uh, what kind of brushes am I using, and on and on. And so that way you 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 have all of the all of the the, the the tools in your tool belt. So we're gonna get started by applying some walnut oil, okay? A little bit of walnut oil on uh, on this canvas, and, and and so this is walnut oil with a brush right here. This is like a, a stain brush, or you can use you can use this about any brush. It doesn't really matter what you use for this. I personally like to use this this uh, four inch stain brushes you can find in any of the home improvement uh, stores and you want to make sure that you get it all over the place if you apply too much walnut oil uh, you could run into a couple of things your painting your paint might thin too much and it might become runny and, and you might not like that okay so let's get to this here's how we're gonna get started I'm going to get my number four brush, get a little bit of black paint, and we're going to start drawing our painting. Essentially, this is, this is the, the, the part where we're going to start designing and drawing the painting. And so loosely, I'm going, to be, I'm going to be basing it on the drawing that I have already. This is an ink drawing. This is a, a pen, pen on paper. And, and there's a reason for that. One of the reasons is uh, pe people keep asking me why why don't why won't you show something like a reference photo or something else? Because the reason why I don't do that is because this type of painting is intuitive, and you don't want to have this idea of fixed colors, fixed everything. We want to go ahead and explore it, so I put it in a very minimalist in a very minimalist approach. Okay, just a little drawing. So we're gonna start with a little bird right here. Look at that. We're gonna start with a little bird and then slowly start moving. By the way, if you move a bit slow, it, don't, don't, it's, it's better to move a bit, a, a bit slow than, than faster, especially when you're starting out. So don't feel bad if you're moving slow. You don't need to move fast. There's no necessity for that. It could be that something that happens over time, okay? There we go. Very, very simple. Notice how I move my hand like this. Because I, I want to be able to catch the different edges of the brush. So again, this is this is a loose representation of what we're seeing. We're, we're sort of just basing it on this. It doesn't have to be measured uh, precisely or specifically to to that or scaled the same way. It doesn't have to. We're just using it as a as a simple guide. Just to have something to to uh, to look into. Look at that. Very very simple. Go back and get more black paint. I, I hope you can see right here. I'm, I'm, I keep going back and getting more black paint. As I progress, and, and try to have some fun with it too. Don't 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 get too stuck on again, right? Don't get too stuck on it has to look a certain way. It doesn't. It doesn't. The, really, the way that I paint is extremely intuitive, very free, and this is one of the reasons why. Uh, so many people get get uh, attracted to this way of painting because it, it feels very liberating. It doesn't feel like like other styles. There's nothing wrong with other styles. People love. I I I, I love painting different ways. Uh, some years ago, but I, I prefer this much much more. 
because it's so free, you know, it's so free. There's there's a, there's a certain freedom to it. It's almost like you have a permission to do things in a way that that uh, that you can't in other styles. You just can't. It's very difficult. And the reason why it's so difficult is because you 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 you, you tend to think that that it has to look a certain way. So this is the first phase of this, okay? This is the design, and we did this with Lamp Black, a number four brush, and we, we sort of just did a little sketch, as if I were to do it with a, a charcoal line, or a marker, or, or just, uh, just the way I did it with some black paint. <laughs> Let's move forward.